Okay, today's project is the absolute nightmare of changing a tube of an E300 <clears throat> Razor scooter product. I'm not going to go over the uh, simple stuff very much. Basically, you take off your chain guard, <clears throat> take out the nut, the nut, and this wheel will want to drop down. You can keep the nut back on this one once you loosen it a little just so you could have something to hit a hammer on tap it down this will slide down <clears throat> out comes the wheel and then you're basically left with this do not make the mistake like i did of taking out the four bolts because once you do everything spins and you will never succeed so keep those and I only put two back in just for it to hold. But basically, what needs to happen is righty tighty, lefty loosey. If you can actually put your leg down on it like this, and if you keep these bolts in, you'll be able to form leverage on this. If you don't, the whole wheel rim and everything spins. So there's a few ways to do it. The way I did it was got this air chisel, got right in this hole right here, and just hit it couple times and it broke loose uh, another way you could probably if you don't have one of those stick a screwdriver in like this push your leg down your knee down to hold it put the screwdriver in and then hit the screwdriver downward and then that will loosen it once you crack it loose it will it will unscrew but it's a matter of getting it down screw once you get it down screw now you have access here now take out your four bolts and see that uh, sleeve in there? That's like the uh, axle shaft, I guess. <clears throat> anyway, you take out these four bolts, this pops out, you have access to the tube from there. Uh, I have other videos on how to change the tire as far as putting the tube in and out and how to do it and blow it up a little bit and let it back out, all that. So check those out. But that part's the nightmare. See, it's threaded. Anyway, that's the hardest part, figuring that out.